Hello and welcome to the tutorial on subtraction of two four digit numbers and we're going to do this with carrying. Let's have a look at the question we're going to work through. What is 6,484 minus 2,988? So it looks quite tricky, doesn't it? Well, the first stage is, let's rewrite this question into the vertical format. Let's do that over here. 6,484 minus 2,988. Nice, neat columns. Let's label the columns as we always do. We have the units, tens, hundreds, and thousands. So we have done stage one, which is to rewrite the question from the horizontal format into the vertical format. We are now ready to do the calculation. First step, check the sign, we are minusing. We always start with a column on the right-hand side first, the units column. So what is 4 minus 8? Let's do some workings here. Units, 4 minus 8. What is 4 minus 8? Well, the number 4 is less than number 8, so we cannot do this. What we're going to do is, we're going to take 1 from the number to its left. So let's do that. We're going to cross out, well, the number to its left is this one. We're going to cross out 8. 8 minus 1 is 7. Where does the 1 go that we've taken? It's added to the column on the right. So the units column has now become 14 minus 8. What is 14 minus 8? That's right, the answer is 6. So let's write this down. We're now going to do the tens column. Now I'm just going to change colors so that we can see what we're doing. So the tens column is now, it's no longer the 8, we're looking at 7 minus 8. Let's write this down here. We've got 7 minus 8. Well, we cannot do this because the number 7 is less than number 8. So what we have to do is we're going to take 1 from the number to its left, the 4. That's this one here. And we're going to do the same thing as we did before. So let's do this. We're going to cross out number 4. 4 minus 1 is... Where has the 1 gone? The one we move to the right, that is placed in front of the 7. So the tens has now become 17 minus 8. 17 minus 8. Do you know what that is? 17 minus 8 is 9. I'm just going to change the colors back so we know what we're doing. So that is 9. So we've done the tens. Now we're going to do the hundreds column. And once more, I am going to change colors again. Right, the hundreds column. We've got 3 minus 9. 3 minus 9. Let's write it down here. The hundreds is 3 minus 9. Well, we can't do this because the number 3 is less than number 9. So what we're going to do is we're going to take 1 from the digit to its left. In this case, it's this digit here, the 6. So let's cross out 6. 6 minus 1 is 5. And the 1 we have taken from here, we add to the column on the right, in front of the 3. So this hundreds has now become 13 minus 9. 13 minus 9. That's right. 13 minus 9 is 4. So let's write this down. 
So we've done the hundreds column. Now lastly, we're going to do the thousands column. The thousands column, we've got a nice easy one. 5 minus 2. 5 minus 2. That's right, the answer is 3. And we have our answer. 6,484 minus 2,988 is 3,000. I'm just going to go back here so that I can go back to the same color. The answer is 3,000, 496. That is correct. And that was a tricky one. We give it a, a nice big tick. So that is how we do subtraction of two four-digit numbers with carrying using the vertical format.